Alright you guys, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be doing a natural hairstyle. It's going to be um, two buns. As you can see, I took my wig off and I went ahead and just did a half up, half down. Um, I should have done a video on that. So I guess I need to make another one next time with the half up, half down uh, tutorial and all that good stuff. Um, a nail update, y'all. I don't know if y'all notice my nails, but whenever I get them done, I think I'm gonna show y'all. This is like a cocoa. Um, and I'm gonna start off with wet hair. My hair's dry. I'm gonna get in the shower. And I'm gonna wash it and condition it and all that good stuff. Um, I never do natural hairstyles with um, dry hair. I always do wet hair. Cause it seems like it's more tameable and more easier but that's just me it's up to y'all completely up to you guys but yep i'm going to jump right into it this is going to be an easy easy tutorial i promise um and so just keep watching okay you guys so i'm starting off with freshly washed hair and i'm going to go ahead and start parting my hair the way i want it side part preferably um, I love doing the side part because that's just basically like my go-to. So now that I have the part that I want, I'm going to start wetting my hair again. It kind of dries since I was waiting so long to get started. Um, and I have my towel. And I just basically started with this first um, piece of hair, this first side. Um, and I just brushed through it a little bit um, because the goal is to get it slicked back as possible. Um, but I also have water on it and I'm going to be applying some Eco Styler Gel on it as well once I put it in the back of my head. I went ahead, like I said before, and put the Eco Gel on this specific section. Now, this is still part of the um, part on the side. I think this is like the right part, left part. Um, and I put it in sections just so it could be easier to pull it back into a bun um, slash ponytail. And so that section is done, and we will start on the next section soon. my hair back into the ponytail slash bun um, I usually don't jump right into my edges but I do go ahead and fix those flyaways um, with some more eco styling gel on my edges but that won't completely hold it down I do use edge control but I'm just showing you guys how I basically just smooth it back for the time being So now with the puff in the back, um, I don't want the puff to be dry and brittle looking. So I went ahead and used the um, Shea Moisture um, Leave-In Condition. And then I also went back and just started using my denim brush to brush through it. And I also used Lot of Body Milk. It's like a moisturizing cream for the hair. Also to just make the hair look nice and bouncy and shiny so that it's not just looking dry. I combed through it using the denim brush. I highly suggest using a denim brush because it really helps to detangle and really define the curls even more.
piece um, of my hair. Um, this is the last section and it is also the bang basically. Um, and this is like the most crucial part of the whole hairstyle because you want it to look really neat and nice. I went ahead and re-wet the part again because you know I had wasted some time so it got dry so I added some water to that. And I went ahead and started brushing and detangling it. I had already added some eco styling gel to it. And basically you can make the bang look however you want. You can make it like a swoop or you can make it just um, lay backwards. I like mine kind of with a swoop kind of half like laying backwards. Um, and I'll show you as best I can um, in the next few clips. So now is when I finally lay my edges using the Coconut Shea um, by Eden. I really love this edge control. It smells really good. Um, and it's not that sticky. So when it goes down on your edges, it actually like holds them down. And it doesn't come up. Like you know how some edge control is like sticky and like it doesn't it doesn't hold nothing so this is really good to use um it's at sally's i'll put a link below um from where i got it from um and i'm just gonna go ahead and lay my edges real nice and pretty the way i want um i don't add too much of this product only because i don't need that much so a little bit goes a long way but you can just keep adding until you get that desired look like i said before are really cute but I am finished if you are not subscribed go ahead and subscribe and press that notification button and I will see you guys on the next one